So this is basically voltage bike electric bicycles cycle kit, especially for single speed motors. So what are the components they are providing in the kit? Now we are going to show you. So this is basically hub motor, 250 watt sub motor they are providing in this kit, especially for a single speed. And for multi speed also they will have another motor. So they will, according to your requirement, they will provide you those motors. And this is hub motor and you can see here we are getting one controller so this is supportable up to 15 to 18 mps so it is easy to connect also i will show you assembling in this video also and this is the pedal assist where you can attach it to the pedal and easily we can use it to push the pedal assist and here you can see light and horn switches and this is a light and horn they are providing to travel in the night so it will be very helpful and these are the sensor bridge so by pressing this, it will be cut off, auto cut off to the power. And this is a throttle they are providing here. And this is the spoke. Mainly this is the main point. And when you are getting ordering the kit, you have to see whether your cycle is 26D or 27.5 or 29. So according to your uh, tire size, you have to mention in the requirement. So that they will provide you the spoke according to this. By default, they are providing 26D spoke. And here you can see this controller box. So it is basically to keep this controller like this and to attach to the cycle. So when we attach like this, so it will be the closed position. So it will be waterproof also. And here they are providing a charger also. So this charger basically comes with the auto cut off. And here you can see LI. So this will indicate red light while charging. Once it is completed, it will turn into green. And it is auto cut off also. Even if you forgot off at the keeping charge, it's no problem. And battery they are providing 36 volt 7.5 amps. So up to 35 kilometers it will go in a single charge. So it will have a detachable battery also. So there is a lock. We can lock it and we can unlock it using that. And let's see assembly how to assemble and how much time it is. So this is a motor hub motor. So 250 watts hub motor. So we can use for single speed cycles. And uh, you can see here this comes with a three phase bus and one all sensor wire. So to assemble this, take your controller and uh, just open this. So you can see here there are five wires mainly. So this in this five wires, there are, there are two wires red and black. Those goes to the battery and remaining three wires which is blue, yellow and green. So these are all connected to the hall sensor. According to the color combination, see blue is connecting to the yellow wire and the green wires goes to the green and blue wires I'm connecting to the blue wires after connecting this please attach this lumber to each one so that even if we, they collide each other so it won't touch to each other like this and here you can see this is a hall sensor so you can see that they will be mentioned on every everywhere so that it is easy to detect whether this wire belongs to which motor or which sensor so hall sensor so like this you can connect it to the motor and here you can see pedal assist. To connect this pedal assist, all you need to find is pedal assist. So if you can see here PIS. So this is easy to connect like this. So pedal assist also connected. And you can see here light and horn switches. One is switch and one is light and horn switch. So you can take it here, you can see headlight they mentioned. So if you see here, there are four wires and you can check one has three wires and one has four wires. So the four wires which is uh, here we have to connect to this and another one has three wires we will connect that three wires to this so so like this we can connect here easily completed and you can see here there is mentioned throttle so take your throttle wire and just connect like this so throttle also completed and you can see here two brake wires so for two brake wires they provided two brake wires sensors also so you can see you can attach any brake wire to any one so no issues in this so all you need to do this and connect like this this will be connected like this so you can see here all the connection is completed within five minutes so we can see here motor wire is connected pedal assist wire is connected light on horn switch and light on horn and you can see Brake wires is also connected, throttle is also connected. There are two main wires we have to connect. So that is battery wire 
so you can see here red wire goes to red and after connection just close that so that it will, it will not collide with each other and if we touch both it will create some spark so that I have to close it like this just you have to attach this and test it like this completed now we can see we will run it and we will test it so now we are going to test this motor so how it works and i am going to show you so if you see here there is a ignition key so if you switch on this it will show the battery level indication how much battery left in the battery and just by applying this accelerator the motor will move so how much you have you accelerate the motor will go that much fast so it will go almost 30 km speed and distance up to 35 km in a single charge so this is a throttle and you can see here pedal assist so this is based upon works based upon magnet so it will be attached to the cycle and this is attached to the pedal so so like this it will be rotated when it is uh, rotating to the b so the pedal assist automatically works based upon this mag detecting the magnets and this is how this pedal assist works and this is light and power and you can see the switch light mm, these are the light and power and we are providing here brakes also so auto cut off sensor brakes so this actually works like if you apply the brake the motor power will be cut off for example i will show you if i keep like this so the brake is applied now so if i accelerate it won't move so once if i remove this again so see the accelerator giving accelerator is one so like this it will be working so these are all of the components which we are getting and you can see here it will take only five minutes to assemble all these components and we have tested also it is working fine and these books are the main reason so when you are ordering based upon order based upon your tire size so they will give provide you the exact requirement and this is the this is all the kit we have been tested and you can buy this kit from the old e-bike website and you can order from there so they are providing for mostly affordable prices only and you can get this kit and this is water resistant also so you can convert any cycle into electric easily like this